Oh, hello. Okay, I tried recording this on my camera, but it was not working, or on my camera on my uh, computer, not working. So I'm gonna do my use my little flip cam. So if I apologize if it's shaky, if you to see my booby or something, it's three in the morning and I'm half drunk and I'm sorry about everything. Okay, but I really want to do this blog right now. While I'm enthused and excited about the E3 conference. All right. So starting off, I want to go over. Um, here's my notes. Um, I want to go over. Hello. I want to go over uh, Nintendo first. Um, Zelda uh, looked really awesome. I was really excited about the um, the the hand motions and like the hand motions you had to do. Like you actually had to use the real stances, which is really awesome. Um, too bad for Nintendo that the Wii wasn't working. Um, I really don't think it was due to Wi-Fi issues. I think it was due to like um, like the light was shining on the sensor or something. I don't know, but. Poor Nintendo, because their little precious Zelda didn't work, and I felt bad for them, because the game could have been way more cool on the demo. Um, GoldenEye remake. Uh, looks sweet. Not really a GoldenEye player. I know, <laughs> blasphemy to everyone else, but don't really do that too much. Um, uh, graphics, not impressed with. But I'm interested to see how Daniel Craig will do, instead of Pierce Brosnan for the voice in this game. Um, I know a lot of people are excited for that. Um, Epic Mickey, not my deal. <laughs> I totally love to like shoot things, so me and Disney don't really mesh well, but I really think it's calling to an older audience. Um, the environment matters. Like, they use the old storyboards. They use Steamboat Willie, or, ugh, Steamboat Willie in a map, so it looks really cool. And some of the animations are really awesome. They uh, have, it looks like they took it out of a book and then animated it. It looks really good. I have to I have to give them props for that. Next one is uh, Epic Yarn um, from Kirby. Very cute. Um, I think that it'll appeal to girls, it'll appeal to boys, it'll appeal, it'll appeal to normal players, Harker players, because who doesn't love Kirby? It's a pink little thing that's cute and cuddly and meh, but kind of evil in a little way. Um, the animations looked really sweet. Um, the yarn was the yarn graphics are on point. Um, looked really great. Uh, that comes out fall two thousand ten. Um, does anyone else notice about the use of epic in gaming? Describing like an adjective, epic. This it was epic. I used epic fail in my last blog. Um, we gotta come up with a new word or something. I'm gonna start saying bitchin, Kirby bitchin yarn. <laughs> Sounds way better. Um, the last game. I want to talk about for the Nintendo conference is Metroid the Other M, which had an awesome soundtrack. Awesome soundtrack. Um, graphics were alright. Um, I kind of wish it had more of a game demo than a trailer. Um, that, that seemed to be kind of the problem with Nintendo. Uh, Nintendo's conf ugh, Nintendo's c God, three in the morning and I can't talk. Nintendo's conference. Um, they really only had one demo, which was Zelda. That didn't even work. Um, and all the rest were kind of trailers, so that was disappointing. But this game looks pretty legit out August 31st, so hold on to your pants. Um, and then the most anticipated, probably the best part of the whole damn showcase for Nintendo was the Nintendo 3DS, which is like a portable 3D um, 3D gaming console. So in my thing, the first thing I wrote for my notes for the E3 conference was, looks like a sexy sandwich because apparently I was hungry. <laughs> um, really, really shiny. 3.5 inch widescreen display. Um, full 3D graphics without the glasses, um, which you have to use to by adjusting a slider. And you can choose a different amount of 3D you want. So if you want it really 3D, you can move it one way. If you don't want any 3D, I'm assuming you can move it to the other spectrum. Um, I'm interested to see how this will turn out because I'm kind of skeptical. It's one of those things I probably have to play with in my hands to really believe it. Um, but anyway, I'm going to move on to uh, the, the Sony uh, showcase. Um, they start off with Killzone 3 and 3D. Not really a Killzone fan. Uh, the only thing I really liked about it was uh, they had a jetpack. I like jetpacks. Um, and they were talking about epic cinematic moments, which, you know, everyone loves the word epic, apparently. But... I didn't, I wasn't really impressed, I, ugh, impressed, it was too gray and too, looked boring to me, it looked like any other game, um, 
blah blah blah. Um, then they have they, then they demoed uh, the move. And the first game they showed with uh, the the PlayStation Three move was Sorcery, which was kind of like a Harry Harry Potter meets like Zelda. Um, you can change things into animals with spells. You can look like a little fairy moving the little dildo move thing around. Um, I'm sorry, those move things are. Whoever came up with those must have been in cahoots with the iPad and just trying to get the female market subconsciously or something. It was freaking awful. Um, but it looked okay, sorcery. Not really anything that we haven't seen before with Harry Potter. Um, Ratchet and Clank, they're trying to keep it old school. Old school PlayStation. Uh, I wish I would have shown more gameplay. They just showed a really crappy trailer that showed nothing what the game did, really. So that kind of sucked. Um, Coca-Cola product placement. Woohoo! God. Just show me the games. I don't really care about Coca-Cola. Like, I'm not gonna buy a fucking can to get a dumb video game character on the side of the can. I'm not an uber nerd like everyone else. Well, not everyone, but, you know. Um, anyway, besides that, I just had to write that down because it was stupid. Um, Kevin Butler was really funny when he started about, like, the jokes about the Xbox, even though, oh, the Xbox is my baby. And I will never betray it, but towards the end of his little uh, funny speech, he started to get a little too lovey with video games. He thought he was God. He's like, oh, I love video games. Everyone buy one. It was, it was old news. It was old. Like, go away. Um, <laughs> uh, let's see. I'm laughing at nothing. <sighs> my boob is trying to come out of my shirt. Sorry, guys. Uh, going backwards. Going the wrong way. All right. Last page announced. Um, oh. The move. Move comes out September 15th for the UK and September 19th for the United States. Uh, one controller costs $49.99. So 50 bucks. 50 bucks for one. Most of the games need two controllers, so we're already looking at $100 for one person to play. If you want your friends to play, good fucking luck. You're going to rack up 400 bucks on goddamn controllers. At least with the Xbox Connect, you have to pay the $150 and everyone can play and you don't need stupid controllers and you don't need stupid batteries and blah, 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 blah. That's why I love Xbox. They're more innovative. Um, to me, the PS Move is just like a dildo version of the Wii <laughs> with a little bit better sensors. Um, anyway, moving on with the Sony uh, press conference at E3. Um, Portal 2... Hello, Valve. Hello, Valve. Thanks for betraying me. Thanks for... How can you premiere Portal 2 at the frickin' Sony E3 conference? Ugh. My heart just died. Um. Uh, I don't know. I don't know, Valve. You just have never released shit on time. You never do anything that I want you to do, so... Um. If you just bring Left 4 Dead to... PS3, I'll just be heartbroken and never play it. It's our, it's our game. Our Xbox and PC people, our game. PS3 can't have it. You have Blu-ray, so screw you. Um, anyway, moving on. Um, last and final thing I'm going to talk about is the Twisted Metal, um, which looked really freaking awesome. Also calling back to the old gaming uh, Sony, PlayStation stuff. Um, really fucking scary Ice Cream Man, though. What the hell? Clowns? Don't dig. I mean, I know it goes with the game, but that was a pretty scary entrance. Really bitchin'. Not epic. Bitchin' entrance. Um, gameplay looks fun. It looks really fun. I'm really excited to see how that'll be. Maybe I'll... I could never get a PS3, but maybe I'll play it at someone's house or something. Um, anyway, I'm done with those notes. Uh, hopefully this will work. Hopefully I don't sound like too much of a drunk. It is 3.05 in the morning. Um, oh, I'm going to go to bed, but make sure that you keep uh, tuning in and reading my blog. I really appreciate it. Please comment. I love interacting with all of you. Um, please add my Twitter if you haven't already. S-T-R-N-G-M-O-U-S-T-A-C-H-I-O. Strong Mustachio is my Twitter. And if you want, you should add my Xbox uh, Gamer Tag. Capital S-I-L-K space S P E C T R three, so it's it's like Silk Spectre with a three instead of an E. Anyway, um, have a good day, night, whatever time you're viewing this, and I'll catch you later, guys. Bye bye.